Hey everybody, I am the Creative Lady and this is Nappylicious TV. So today is January 15th, 2019. Today is a special day for two purposes, of course. Today is the birthday of the late great Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. So happy birthday to the King. And we will uh, celebrate his birthday with the official holiday on Monday, January 21st. Secondly, today is the founder's day of Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority Incorporated. We celebrated 111 years of existence today, service to mankind, y'all. So we've been greeking it out, pinking and green in it out all week. So it's gonna continue tomorrow, but especially on today. Today I wore my pearls from the Ivy Storehouse one of the Ivy boxes and I wore my um, shirt from the Greek painter 1908 I'll leave the information down below so part of any organization especially Greek organizations of course you always see people wearing the paraphernalia and fellowshipping and, and stepping and all of that and chanting but it's more than that everything is pretty much based on service to other people in service to mankind that is our motto as ladies of alpha kappa alpha sorority and i had gone to my you know people in my building and say look we're always posting photos and you know wearing paraphernalia let's make sure that we stay true to what our founders stood for we are educators let us do something different so they all got together and came up with an idea that we would start a service project for our students. And what we are doing is uh, creating a, a closet for our students to help them with, you know, toiletries and things like that because some kids come to school and if you are in education, they're not always, you know, properly um, with hygiene, you know, the right hygiene. So we put together uh, a, a list of things that each group uh, each group would bring to help stock the pantry. So the ladies of AKA were responsible for creating, I think like the spray deodorant. And if you think about it, the roll-ons wouldn't be sanitary. So we wanted something that was going to spray so that, you know, more than one student could get use out of it. So I stopped today and picked up a few things from the Dollar Tree and I'll show you what I picked up. Um, I think I got everything in here so first I found, when I first walked in, I was like, I'm gonna need something to put it in. So the first thing that I saw were these little baskets and I got two of the pink baskets and um, I should have gotten a couple more or just like one big one, but anyway. So I bought a bunch of cans of deodorant and I think, I don't know if this is men, women's, I don't know, but the power stick brand from the Dollar Tree and I got I think about seven of this kind one two three four five six and seven and I made sure to get the ones that have at least a 20% more on the sticker so that we could get more for our bang and I see that this one is for her. That's the only one that I saw for women. So I guess all of these are for men and child and boys. We need some deodorant. So I don't think this is gonna go to waste. So also, when I also bought oh, these right here, I bought two containers. Two, they will sit on the shelf, you know, like the pack. Two of these, and these are the personal care for men and it's a quick dry antiperspirant spray and this is what they're looking like and they're in these little little containers like this one dollar each you know i guess you can get a couple uses out of it uh it's a lightweight long lasting and old odor protection so this is supposed to be a clean scent so if you're a girl or a boy i believe we should be able to get some use out of it so let's just see Yeah, it's not too masculine so if you need some deodorant you know this will be something easy breezy to put on so i did get like i said two containers of these and then i also bought a couple of bags so that i could transport them in um 
for tomorrow. I got this Minnie Mouse bag. It was pink and green. I thought that was adorable. And then I got this um, green bag. And then I also bought this one that has love on it. Little floral patterns. Something quick and easy, inexpensive, in order to, you know, help stock the pantry. I also bought something for myself, y'all. Look, I am still still a big kid. Captain Crunch cereal. I'll be eating this for dinner tonight, okay? So I got that. And so what else? I bought something else that you know, I wanted to share with you all. Um, oh, here. So when I got home, I had a couple packages from Amazon, a couple of books, and then I had some um, new bands for my watch. I have the Apple Watch, and I wanted a, a pearl-like band. So I got this band. I don't know if you can, can, can really see it, but it's like a rose gold or light pink shade. I like that. And they were very inexpensive. And then the second one, the second one that I bought, if I can get into it this is what it comes like I don't know it's too much lighting can't really see it but it comes with this little protective clear thing that I will not put on my watch because I had one on there before and it kind of left like a little permanent smudge on it I mean I'm always having to clean it and this comes with some type of little tool I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this tool maybe I don't know but uh, it comes in this little dust bag or a little drawstring bag, bag. And this one is the pearl one, the white pearl one. So I absolutely love it. I can't wait to wear it this week. I'm gonna change them out this week. And I'll leave these linked down below if you want to see what else this company has to offer, okay? All right, guys, just wanted to pop on really quickly to say happy Founders Day, happy King Day, part one to everyone. So thank you for watching this video. I will see you really, really soon. I'm going to also probably insert some of my little outfits today and some of my sorority sisters who I took, had a chance to take some pictures with on Founders Day. It's all about sisterhood and unity and service to mankind. A couple of my sorority sisters, I think they do follow my channel. Hey, Crystal. My star Crystal, she pledged in Connecticut and then she went on to help found a chapter in Japan. So she is global, honey. All right, hey girl, hey. But anyway, y'all, I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, y'all.